Hello, my beautiful crafty friends. How is everyone doing? I hope you're having an amazing start to your season so far. Christmas is literally seven days away. Say what? The, I feel like we should be still celebrating Halloween. Is anybody else having their time fly so fast? It's so annoying. But anyways, this is probably going to be my last video before Christmas to be able to be more personable with you guys. I am going to do a personalized Dollar Tree elf video, but that's more than likely going to be a process video. So I went to Hobby Lobby today and I wanted to show you you guys what I got from Hobby Lobby. I got some Merry Mail and I wanted to tell these ladies thank you and show you guys how gorgeous these cards are. I had to run upstairs real quick and get them off my mantle because I am displaying them. This is from Rebecca over at Re uh, Crafts with Rebecca and there you go. So you can go check her out because she makes gorgeous cards y'all. Look at these colors. They just work so well together. Miss Rebecca, thank you so so much. I did not expect this. When I received it, I almost cried. I felt so special. So thank you. Thank you so, so much from the bottom of my heart. And then this one comes to us from Terrace. Um, I'm not too familiar. I thought it was Terry at first because I, I read it down here and it looked like Terry, but then I actually flipped it over and this is from Terrace. So Terrace, thank you so, so, so much. I love the embossing that you use and I'm having a hard time deciding if this is a stamp or if this is part of the paper. And that's actually really good because if it's actually part of the paper or it's a stamp and it's not part of the paper, then you made it look like it was scrapbook paper, girl. It looks absolutely beautiful. You guys warmed my heart so much with these cards. And I just wanted to make sure that I got to tell you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart and everybody that supports me. Thank you so much. It means so, so much to me. You guys do not understand how much more um, fun. You make my crafting journey and I just really appreciate each and every one of you and the relationships that we've created and all that great stuff. You know what I'm trying to say. I'm, I'm not, I don't want to be too sappy and this camera is all kinds of jacked up, isn't it? <laughs> I actually have my old iPhone up here. I thought I'd give it a go with I'm, um, uh, iMovie editing, but yeah, I just want to say thank you so, so much. I know some can be hard. The holidays can be hard for some. And I just want you guys to know that I'm thinking of you. Um, the holidays aren't always best with us either. So I just want to let you guys know you're not alone, obviously. I know especially this year with times being tough with um, our finances and inflation and all that good stuff. You guys are definitely not alone. I don't know if you guys know this or not, but Kev actually lost his job a couple of months ago. So Christmas was really hard on us this year. The boys are, we're extremely blessed. I still have my job. You know, we've been, we were able to provide for our, our boys and I know not everybody can. So let me, let me, let me tell you, you're not alone. Okay. So with that being said, let me show you guys what I got from Hobby Lobby. I was watching this crafter the other day and you guys know I've been working on my, my faces and she actually showed this brush from Hobby Lobby and they actually were on 40% off today. And she said, go get this brush. Your lash game will forever be changed. So they were only $3.99 and 40% off. So I decided to get a real, real thin one. This one is 18.0 or dash zero. And this one's 10.0. And you can see a little bit of a difference on how thin this one is versus this one. And I cannot wait to paint lashes since I got these guys. And then I seen her doing shading and... um with like a real small stippling brush, which I couldn't find, but I figured maybe these stiffer brush would be easier to do it with. And these were $4.49. And then why was there in 40% off? I seen these and this is a paint eraser. Who knew you could erase paint? But girl, I am ready to give it a go. <laughs> they are three different ones. Um, it looks like they're a little bit different on each end, which is so interesting to me, like so interesting. 
And then they had their decor and their crafty stuff for Christmas, 66% off. So of course I couldn't just walk out of there without ribbon, without some kind of decor. Y'all know me. And I definitely shouldn't even went in there to begin with because I have so much decor that I wasn't even able to display it all. I changed the way my, um, I changed my tree this year and I went from Buffalo red check and Buffalo check to woodland. And I actually had enough to fill my tree completely. So if that is how you changing your decor without having to really buy much, I mean, I got too much, you guys. I got way too much. So I picked this little guy up. I thought it was absolutely adorable. We got baby Jesus, Mary Joseph, and it says joy. And it's white with gray. So it goes with any color that I may choose from here on out. I love that. And then this one too, it says all is calm, all is bright. I thought that was beautiful. And then I found this little guy. Isn't he just the greatest? He's so stinking cute. He does light up. And uh, hold on, let me tell you pricing. $5.99, not too bad. This one was $3.99 and this guy was $5.99. And then obviously 66% off. But I thought he would go so well with my little darling girl that I got at the beginning of the season with her little deer. And he does because he has that vintage vibe, y'all. He is so stinking cute. Um, and I love him. He's so gnarly. <laughs> so, so cute. And then I found more Jingle Bells. These were the last two that they had. They were $5.99 a piece. And I've actually used a couple already in my projects this year. So I knew that I wanted to have more in my stash. And as popular as these bells were this year, bells are always going to be popular around Christmas. So it doesn't hurt to have them in my stash. And then I picked up ribbon. So I picked up this green and this silver, and then I picked up this beautiful ribbon. This one's gorgeous, it's wired. I actually went ahead and made me a hair bow for work tomorrow. Looky there, I thought it would be perfect with my uniform and for Christmas, so I just made myself a sweet little hair bow. Um, and yeah, I'm excited to wear it tomorrow. It's gonna be so, so cute. I'm trying to decide if I wanna add a little center and make it Christmas. Um, between these two little pieces, but I don't think I am because I might be able to get away with this hair bow for winter. And then the last thing that I picked up from Hobby Lobby are these sweet little angels. How adorable would this be in gold vinyl saying the kids' names? You get six for $8.99, so not bad at all. So these were $3.99 and this one was $10.99. So very, very good pricing. And then y'all, I found some adorable green ribbon at the Dollar General the other day. How flipping cute is that? And then I also found these adorable reindeer ornaments. Aren't they just the cutest? Oh my goodness. They're so stinking cute, you guys. So I'm gonna film the process of me doing these little elves. It is already 9.34 and I need to get my butt in gear because I gotta work in the morning and I gotta take these little elves Eve with me. But it, I got down here at uh, 8.30, I think, and it's taken me this long just to film this little snippet, you guys. I keep messing up on my words. I forgot to grab the cards, and I forgot some of the pieces for the Hobby Lobby haul and all that. St oh, wait, wait, wait. See? This is why it's taking me so long. The last thing, the very last thing that I, I forgot to show you guys, and it's the most adorable thing. I got this garland before my craft room, and I think it is the girliest, daintiest, sweetest little garland ever. I cannot wait to display it. I actually picked up two of them, and I got both for 10 bucks, not 10 bucks each, both for 10 So $5 for this garland, I am here for it. It's actually kind of long, so I don't know if I'm going to double it up or what I'm going to do, but it is the sweetest. I got it for my bookshelves. Um, when you guys see the craft room tour, pro probably with the revamp, you'll see that I put up a bunch of cubes, and I thought they looked so pretty in the cubes. But yeah, that's the last thing I picked up from Hobby Lobby. So anyways, guys, thank you so, 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 so much for always supporting me, always watching my videos, my OG subscribers. You guys are amazing. My new subscribing subscribers, you guys are awesome as well. Um, I hope you guys have a fantabulous Christmas. Uh, just Christmas is a state of mind and it, you can make it what you want it to be. So I just really hope that everyone is out there being saying stay staying safe 
and just know that you're blessed and that you're loved at least from this way um until next time you guys i will talk at you later bye bye now merry christmas